Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television, GPTV. I'm Brett, and my hands is Horse Trouble by Kristen Varner, published by First Second Out this week. Really cute graphic novel, really interesting stuff, kind of based somewhat on uh, Kristen's life. Uh, she said it's, it's based, it's not word for word, not totally uh, accurate to everything they have to her. But the general gist of it is she was a little bit chubby when she was uh, younger and had some uh, body issues. Of course, there's also boys she has to deal with, but the big thing is she's really into horses. Um, she loves horses. Uh, Unfortunately, her best friend is allergic to him, uh, and this is a and kind of a growing up, not quite coming of age, but definitely a growing up, uh, maturing story about a girl who learns confidence through riding horses and becoming friends and standing up to bullies and making those uh, good decisions of, of standing up for herself and like really kind of taking control of her life. Um, this is a, a solid, solid read. It's it's entertaining. It's really cute. The thing that I, I think is really impressive about it is that it goes kind of in-depth into about uh, horses, about horse riding, uh, and the competition and the terminology used. And what's really neat is it'll go through a page, and it'll talk about stuff, and it'll use some of that terminology, and then it'll make sure to have that terminology uh, towards the bottom of the page so that you know what's going on and aren't lost in the story uh, based off of just the terms, which I think is really, really neat, which makes it very uh, educational reading it. And I think there's something uh, uh, really positive about that. I think it's, it's pretty cool. Um, overall, like, I, I like it. I mean, there's something that I think is really, um, it's easy to, like, connect with it. You know, I think a lot of us have body issues and, you know, concerns. And there was a while, a while when I was growing up that I was really hefty. And, um, you know, going through the, the psychological impact of that and, and wanting to lose weight and, and oh, I don't want a snack, but I'm hungry and, like, you know, stress eating and all that stuff. You know, I think it's something, like, even at 40-something, I can still relate to this. Um, I still stress eat and you know in that way like I think it's really solid like there's just something that's very universal about the story uh, for younger kids I think this is great for probably like 10 to maybe 13 14 somewhere around there um, the kids might learn pick up some lessons on, on standing up for yourself and and gaining confidence through doing stuff and I think there's really positive uh, lessons within about that um the art is, is cool like I, I like this bluish hue that it uses. There's a little bit of red here and there to highlight some stuff, uh, but the characters are all very distinctive. They all have their own style and look, um, and it just, it works. It works really, really well. And the thing is, like, you don't have to be into horses to appreciate or enjoy the graphic novel. Let me see if I can find, yeah, here we go. So like here on the bottom, you can see you can see some text maybe. Text is an explanation of what the terms are used. So tack gear such as the saddle and uh, brittle that is worn by horses to help people ride, breeches, riding pants. Like it's cool that it goes through and, and teaches you the language of the story and that's used. Um, overall, like I, I really like it. There's there's photos of the creator, there's stuff with the sketches uh, of the characters, a little bit on the process. So there's like some extra cool stuff in the back as well. Um, overall, like, I'm, I'm super happy with this. I think it's a really cool graphic novel. I think it's really educational. There's some great stuff for kids. Um, as an adult, I, I even enjoyed it, and it could relate to the character. So I recommend it. I think it's it's some solid stuff. It's it's a good read, especially, I think, for younger kids. Uh, out now, you can go get it. we got a, a link beneath this video. Open your zip code to tell the comic shops near you. No shop, no problem. We do have some links as well we can purchase. There'll be affiliate links so we get a small percentage by doing that. You'll support our site, so thank you. And speaking of support, I want to thank First Second for hooking us up with a review copy. And, of course, thank you all for watching. If you're into comics, if you're into graphic novels, check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, all at Graphic Policy, keeping it nice and consistent. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos. Or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.